We'll be getting started in just a little while, everybody. We'll be getting started around the two minute mark, so get those sales prepared and we'll be getting started real soon. Let's see how long it takes stream elements to pop in the chat to let me know that I'm live. And also, let's see if anyone you know, shows up before I begin the uh, festivities. should be good for time being. Just uh, lowering the game audio with my volume mixer. But anyway, it is now past the two minute mark, so hey all my fellow Rumble Maniacs, it's Mr. Rumble Roses here. And welcome back to some more of Bloodstain Curse of the Moon. So, in the last stream, we did the Nightmare Mode portion of the game, where we played as the original three characters, uh, as as the uh, three additional characters. I mean, I mean, I meant to say. Um. If you hear any barking or whatever, forgive me, my doggies, um, he hates being alone at times, but anyway. Um, so last time we played the Nightmare Mode, we played it on casual, and we played as the three characters that you would get along your journey, uh, after defeating the first few bosses. We tried in an attempt to save the main protagonist's, you know, life and all that, but it seemed like as but it seemed as though like we were only able to save his soul or something like that. Um, it was kind of a rough battle, but in the end we managed to get through it. Granted, yes, it was on casual, so lives didn't really matter, as you can see under the stage thing. So, what I wanted to try and do is to unlock the third mode in this game. Uh, hold on. Okay. What I'm going to try and do is, I'm going to try and unlock, see if I can unlock the third mode in this game. And I've done a little bit of research. Although, like, it's still kind of up in the air if it's actually the truth or whatnot. But, I think the way that you can be able to get to the third mode is if you play the game normal, but you take out the allies that you that you would get along the way, and you just play the thing with the main protagonist, but you have, like, you know, their soul, the souls of the ally characters, and you announce new abilities and whatnot. And that should un and if you manage, if you beat the game, then you should be able to unlock the third and possibly final mode, which I think is called ultimate mode. So in this stream, I'm going to attempt to just you know play it as such and see how things go. 
Yeah, you can see Cutter Game under certain certain conditions, so I'll this mode. Now, I've been doing a lot of my Let's Plays of this game as of late on casual, and I know some people might be like saying like, why do that, or, you know, doesn't that take the challenge or whatever away from the game? And, um, you know, make it like this, like that, or whatever, and I'm just gonna go ahead and say it right now. I'm doing pretty much everything in this game that, 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 that there is. I'm starting off like small per se, where I'm playing the game on casual mode and doing everything everything in that, and then maybe one day for a stream I will play the game um, in like a maybe normal and nightmare mode, and then I will try and see how I do in the veteran style. But for right now, I'm gonna play the game normal, I'm gonna play it on casual, and just go at it alone, with no allies, and see how that goes. <sighs> I don't know if how you pronounce that correctly, but I think it's like... Zangasu? <laughs> Hopefully the game quality, I mean hopefully the game audio sound is not as loud because I went into my volume mixer to lower it down to some, around like the 60 mark or something. So. you get in this in this uh, level but I don't know what happens for the rest and that does leave me quite curious I don't know for sure, but this may be the last time I play the game on on a casual setting. Like, you know, maybe I if I beat if I beat this game on casual and I unlock the third mode and whatnot, then I might try and consider stepping it up and playing it on veteran skill. Let's see how that goes. I mean, I've been basically playing this on casual mode because 
Like I'm still learning some of the stuff in the game and figuring out like what you know, happens when you do certain things here and there and whatnot. Not to mention I'm still, you know, getting a feel for how the game is on all the modes. Ouch. I'm assuming that with this character, the two side weapons that you can be able to use are like the upper whip attack and the like fire paper thing. Both are pretty good in my opinion. If I was using that, if I had allies, I would probably um, have him use the fire paper. Especially for like, you know, certain situations. Hopefully one of my mods is able to come around during the stream. I know, I know, I know one of my other mods is not going to be able to since um, he's visiting his former foster mom. From what he said. Defeated. A new solar has stirred within you. Thank you, Adam, for the host. Much appreciated. Crescent moon. X while in the air. So basically, it's this. It, yeah, it's that. <laughs> Mm. 
Now from here on out, I don't know what the other powers are going to be for the other characters, so this should be interesting. Though I vowed to trust no one and fought my way here by myself, I seem to have reached my limits. No one is without strengths and weaknesses. Continuing alone would be a fool's journey. If I only had an ally I could trust. If I were to meet someone like that, whom I could form an alliance with, I'd exclaim, Let us fight together! No matter what powerful skill I may learn, it would never be a trusty companion. I pray that there is a man cursed drift against the flow of time. If such a curse were to exist, even I could defy the past and start anew. Well, as much as I'd like to have, like, you know, allies with my soul, I'm gonna have to go at this alone to try, and to try and unlock the third and possible final game mode. Damn, I was hoping they drop something. I may use the fire paper for right now. If not, my were actually a thing in the veteran mode. Ooh, I'd be so pissed. Especially if that was the case around that part of the game.
Entels frogs. I wish I could get that, but I can't slide. Too close. <sighs> A 
new song when it has started within you. Let's see if this adds to it or... Oh, okay. Blood Moon. A hey, while in the air. Okay, so it's like a double jump. So I got a force flash in the air and I got a double jump. It's so hard to fucking like do that when they're in the air. Yep, can't go down there unless you want to take like some great yeah damage. Or if you had like that wizard guy with the uh, freezing ability, with, with his freezing ability, I mean. Yeah, you point down there, skeletal dude, but I can't do a slide. I know I'm full already, but I'll gladly take it. <sighs> One sec, folks. Okay.
I wanted to go that opposite way. That's first death. God damn it. I bet I'd been into the pain in the ass if I had if I had the knockback. Damn, I want so badly. I cannot get it, so... I wouldn't be too surprised if I can't be able to get um, a good majority of the items and whatnot. I guess that is the proof I play for having to go at the saloon. Oh, it's Mr. Moneybag.
Ouch. There we go. This soul I don't have started within you. Let's see what I get from this guy. New moon, double tap a direction and press V. Stage four. I'm guessing this fire ability, like, maybe increases how strong the sword slashes is. I might try and keep the whip for right now. Tra um, Shadow, if you can hear me and you're watching the stream, can you tell me how the game audio is? Because I did a little bit of, I, I lowered the game audio with my sound mixer on my computer. And I'd like an opinion on if it's still good to hear everything, especially like you know with me talking over it. All right, cool. Thank you, Shadow. Did you share the stream around, by the way? That's fine, and thank you for sharing. I know, like, today, you know, and probably tomorrow, you're gonna have to be, like, the main mod for my channel, since Onyx is, you know, doing his own stuff. Let's 
good thing I'm playing on casual. Cause you know, I don't know if I can do what have I don't know if I can deal with the lives and the knockback when I get hit and stuff. I had a feeling you were gonna clip it, but thank you for clip for the clip nonetheless. Damn fire boo. I do like the double jump in this game, I will say. Doggo or cat. I don't know what I don't know what he is. Yeah, I'm not going that way.
I know I have the double jump, but I don't really want to risk that. Bitches. Another bush. Ouch. 
Let's be careful here. 